I have, okay, another Planner Kate haul, and I just, I love her stuff, and I'm, I think I'm really figuring out what I need, and like how much of it I need, and I'm just trying to kind of like, I don't know, figure everything out, and so the hauls will be coming. <laughs> That's all I have to say about that. So let's go ahead and get everything out. Super fun. I'm so excited about this order because I feel like this is an order that I kind of like knew what I was doing, you know, like if that makes sense. Let's, oh, the tissue paper is already done for. <laughs> but the, the sticker is coming off nicely, demonstrating the ability for it to be removable. Okay, so we have a kind of a lot here. It looked like a bigger order than it actually was because I got some storage things. So originally I bought this storage album, but I needed to get a bigger one. This one actually fits my Mama Gloria kits really nicely because of the size. So I think I'm gonna use that one for that. And then here are a few stickers, but then, okay, so I got two of the refills and then I got some of the dividers, but I got basically, this is the eight by 10 sticker album. And I did that because I wanted to be able to put everything that like goes together together and then everything else I can put in the smaller one. I figure that's kind of how I'm going to work. I might even get one more for like separate brands and other little like things like the little date dots and that kind of thing. And then kits will go in one. I'm just trying to figure out how to organize things best. So these are the dividers. I don't know if I'm gonna open them because you're not gonna be able to see them very well. So it's gonna look kind of like the other ones, right? So they're just like clear frosted dividers. Yep, and then I can divide it into sections. So whether that's like seasonally or what have you, like you can't really see that very well, but I don't have, I don't have a piece of paper to put behind it. But anyway, they're just like clear frosted dividers. And then I got two, and I'm, I don't think I'm gonna open these yet. I'm gonna kind of wait until I've used them, but I got two refills of the eight by 10 inserts. So that makes 60 sheets plus I think 30 come in here. So I think that should be enough for, for a while. Otherwise I need to slow down my sticker habit. So honestly, I didn't buy that many stickers even though the box looked big. So never fear. And then I might like take these discs off. I like the cuteness of the clear, but I think I might do like Happy Planner Expander metal discs or something because then I'll have enough room for everything. Okay, so then I'm gonna get these all organized and put together. So then I'll show you kind of what goes with what. Okay, so we've got them all organized. Okay, so the la in my last haul, I picked up the I picked up the Lakeside Make Your Own Monthly, but I realized I didn't have anything like to go with it functionally to like write things in the month. So I have these now. So I don't think I'm gonna do my August plan with me on camera because we're like basically ready to plan September, which is crazy to say. So I will just go ahead and do that off camera and then maybe I'll share some photos of it over on Instagram. If you're not already following me, you can check that out over on Instagram at creating in chaos underscore official. And then, okay, and that was four by seven by nine. That's what I got those for. And then this one is another, it's a little A5 kit and it's kit 633. I can never remember the names. Also my eight year old has a friend over and they're outside screaming. So if you hear anything, I am so sorry. <laughs> you probably won't cause I'm gonna voice isolate this if I hear anything <laughs> when I'm editing. But anyway, if you do, I'm so sorry. Okay, so it's this little like cutesy like underwater type kit. It's adorable, I really like it. Okay, here are like some functional things with that box. I did end up getting these again. That was like after I realized that I probably won't use those because they're a size that doesn't really work that well for me. And then I got these boxes that do work well next to the time. I got the week at a glance and then I got some more of these boxes which work well. So that's an adorable kit too. And then I thought this was super cute. This little like taco kit. I thought this was kind of like summery vibes. I'm sure it's like Cinco de Mayo, but it's fine for me for summery. I like it. 
Okay, cute. I got the decorative or the shadow boxes and this is kit 622. I just love the primary colors in this. So cute. Oh, love it. Okay. And then here are the other two things for my A5 daily. And some of you were saying be careful about using kits in your A5 planner. And I totally get that. But I just love, I just love the look of kits in my planner. And I love the look of it being like almost overly decorated. I don't know. For some reason that just really trips my trigger and works for me like on an organizational front. So I don't know. It helps me to be more motivated if I look in my planner and I'm like, oh, it's so cute. Okay. And then this is kit 542. I got this one on sale, which is a great thing. And it's a little like coffee kit, which I thought was adorable. I love a good coffee. I just am a decaf girly. Okay. Because I don't know, I get really bad anxiety if I have too much caffeine. And then I also, I don't know, it gives, I don't like the headache part of it when I'm drinking coffee every day anyway. So I'm, I just drink decaf. If I need a boost, I'll have like a diet Coke or something every once in a while, but not every day. And then I got the week at the gla at a glance, some of these boxes, but I just really like this color palette too. I liked how it all kind of went together. It doesn't look like, oh yeah. Did I get the headers page? Oh yeah. So this is kind of like the little coffee print with all of that. Yeah, so that's really cute too. So that is another, and these probably won't even go into like the storage bin because these I'm gonna use to finish back planning, which I'm almost done with. It's crazy, but I, I gotta have it complete. Okay, and then I got a September monthly kit, and this is kit 540, and it's so pretty. I just love the plaid, it's adorable. I'm so glad it's here because I'm about ready to plan September in both of my planners. Love. Okay. And then I got November monthly for my A5. Cute. Yeah. Oh, and that's, these are for the dashboard and then the functionally type things. And then of course our like month setup. Then I got December. This one's really cute too. I love this. I think I got this in the seven by nine as well. So I'll have like some of the same prints around. That's kind of the thing about using different planners. Like I'm noticing that maybe I want to mix in a few more shops so that I can have more variety. And then this one is for January. So this is the monthly cute. And then the boxes functional things. I'm not sure why I got this week at a glance, but I'm sure I'll be able to use that as an extra somewhere. And then I got the August dashboard page because I have an August monthly but I don't think I got like the dashboard setup part of it. So I grabbed this to have, but that is really all the stickers that I got. The, oh, and I forgot to show you, this is the sampler stuff that she sent over, which I so appreciate because I grab from these sometimes when the kit isn't quite complete enough, when I'm missing a few things. So there is that. So that is everything. Again, this is more of like an organization, like get your stuff together kind of haul. But I thought I would show you the cute little stickers that I picked up because then I can start putting them in my planner. Let me know what was your favorite and let me know how planning is going for you guys. Are you still like full sticker mode? Are you into that? Like what is going on in your planning life? Let me know because I feel like we don't talk about that too much anymore. And then be on the lookout for other videos coming soon. Of course, I'm going to have like all of my September planning coming up very shortly. I'm going to have some cover changes and monthly plan with me's and all that good stuff. So stay tuned for all of that. And if you're new here, hi, my name is Caitlin. I would love it if you would hit that red subscribe button down below and follow along. And if you are one of my current friends, followers of that kind of thing, I am so th thrilled that you're here still hanging out with us. You are a wonderful and I so appreciate you. So thanks for being here. And then if you would like to find me anywhere else, you can check me out over on Instagram at creating in chaos underscore official. And you can also check me out on TikTok at create in chaos I think that is the handle. Again, I'll, it'll be linked down below. I can never remember that one because it's different. And then if you would like to also, I do have some affiliate links and coupon codes that if you are doing any planner shopping, you can shop through those links down below. And by the way, you guys have fun today.